Welcome to the Delaware Mortgage Rate Weekly Update. Hello, I'm John Thomas with Primary Residential Mortgage. This is your update for the week of April 30th, 2012. Well, in the news last week, we saw that the Federal Reserve Committee met and discussed the economy and released their notes. Uh, the Federal Chairman, Ben Bernanke, basically acknowledged the conditions of the economy are improving, but very modestly. And he also noted that the housing market remains depressed. One example of this is last week we saw the new home sales released, which actually fell 7.1% to 328,000 units, as you can see in the graph. We were um, higher in February. It looked like we were on a trend to new home, um, to home sales being higher, and now they've fallen again. Uh, Bernanke also mentioned inflation is uh, higher in the short run due to higher energy costs, but that they see um, prices going to moderate and not expect inflation to be a problem in the short term. Uh, if inflation does kick in, that is a problem for bonds, which means home loan rates could get worse. Uh, one thing that was not mentioned in the Fed policy was a quantitative easing round three or more mortgage bond buying. Um, I guess they're going to wait to see if the economy can recover. If the housing market stays as a drag on the economy, then they may have to institute QE3. Um, there was also a sluggish read on the economy. The gross domestic product or GDP, which shows how strong our economy is and what we're growing at, came in well below expectations at 2.2%. This was well below the 3% final fourth quarter reading. So this is a definite negative, and that helped bond, uh, mortgage bonds end the week higher, all the way back to all-time historic lows for interest rates. So right now is now is a great time to buy or refinance a home in Delaware. So if you need help doing that, you can give us a call, 302-7030727. Uh, if, if we take a look at the bond page, you can see that uh, we are at all-time historic lows, and then um, that was in January, and then from January, we slowly, the bond sold off and continued down until the uh, middle of March, and you can see it bounced up. From there, we were on a path of going up and down, up and down, but the trend has now been up the total time, and you can see here we are at the end of April, we're back all the way to the historic highs for the bond market, which means historic lows for interest rates. Um, what we have this week coming up is a big report to look at, which is personal income spending and core personal consumption. This shows how consumers feel about the economy. If that comes out very good, that could be a sign that the economy is strengthening, and that could be bad for uh, home loan rates. If it comes out as expected or worse, that would be good news, and rates could stay at all-time historic lows. In the local news, the next free first-time homebuyer seminar in Newark, Delaware, is May 19th, which is a Saturday. It's the Christiana Hilton Hotel. You can register... <coughs> by calling 302-7030727 or register online at DelawareHomeBuyerSeminar.com. The next seminar in Dover is May 22nd. It's a Tuesday at 6.30 at the Sheraton Hotel in Dover. Again, you can register for that at DelawareHomeBuyerSeminar.com. Until next week, look forward to seeing you.